Maybe a huge chat box would be pretty cool. <clears throat> Fucking yeah. Oh, did that get published? No, I said it's the six thirty. Yeah, 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 the Ender Lily stream from yesterday. Welcome back, bear. I'll tell you, I spent the good 20 minutes trying to set this freaking game up because of how um, Streamlabs decides to, you know, make the game really small. <laughs> so I had to basically change up my display to be like this and the reason being is because whenever I open it up you see you see you see it down there but when I full screen it this is technically full screen and it sucks <laughs> I mean I don't mind it I mean, you know, it could be worse, but I had to, like, expand the display capture so much. <laughs> and it just, it just sucked. <laughs> because, hold on. You can see, kind of, yeah, that it is full screen on my computer, but in Streamlabs, it's like, nah, nah. We, we ain't gonna deal with that. So yeah, 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 it was a pain in the butt to try to set up, but... Yeah. Hopefully episode 2 and 3 of this game will not be as troublesome, but it most likely will. So. Ugh. What a... I did Baja Punch last time. I need... Oh, I haven't done... Oh shoot, is this my last can of Winter Oh, it is! It's gone. Today is not sponsored. Spon is not sponsored by Mountain Dew Major Mountain. It's yeah, it's Mountain Dew Major Melon. Get in the stores near you. Delicious. Delicious. Okay. Hmm. It's pretty good. I enjoy watermelon flavor stuff. Next time we'll do 
we'll do do a say <laughs> tomorrow <laughs> for that stream. But yeah, welcome to Hello Charlotte. It's a game recommended by my good friend King Ver. Well, it was more or less not recommended. Yeah, I was just told about it, and he played it. And I asked, hey, is this stream worthy? And he said, yeah. So now we're here today. <laughs> this will be three parts. Um, yeah. Because there's episode one, which is now. There's episode two, which will probably happen some other stream. And episode three, which will happen some other stream. Along with, I think, DLC for episode three. I got that, so we're good on that. But three streams three episodes i don't know how long this will last if it lasts half an hour i guess we're gonna go do episode two but if it lasts you know like a good two hours we can do other things i i i don't know how long this game's gonna be but we're going in we're going in and i'm i'm already really liking this my world met its end a long time ago the humanity as i knew it has ceased to exist and disappeared without a single trace the gods they believed in have died, and churches were built as their graves. The chaos turned into order, and it finally became quiet. All I can do is dream, for I am so, so tired. Before I abandon the words that form noise in my head, will you be so kind as to join me in my dream seeing? Like, hello, skater. Hello, Z-Man991. Hello, Charlotte, episode one. Junk food, gods, and teddy bears. Holy shit, it's white space. <laughs> it is literally... What? Hello, Charlotte. It's so nice to meet you. Please take care of me. I can't. This is... This is my room. What a lackluster design. It's rather minimalistic. Quite modern, don't you think? Let's go to the dining room. I'm hungry. I already don't like this. <laughs> Why is the music just like this? Band-aids, scalpels, notes, tea bags. Everything is such a mess. I don't want to sleep yet. Current user has restricted access to data Omnicube. Please include your to teleport Omnicube corridor. What is happening? Oh, hey, dining room. Dear Charlotte, I'll be home late. Call O eight hundred all those X's to order food from Charlie's XOXO mom. This note is eight months old. The parents work on holidays. New task. Receive food. Hey! We got a heart. Some table board inside. Yeah. User log the house. User log puppet manual. The puppet control menu has four options. Stuff, task, rewind points, exit. Junk is stuff we throw away. Stuff is junk we keep. Tasks are daily life quests. Reward points contain saved data of previous events. NB, one letter off from NB, subscribe to Music Bomber, <laughs> should be used only if the puppet dies, or if the puppeteer must leave the control console. Exit should not be an option for responsible puppeteers. So what you're saying is, I'm not allowed to quit the game until I complete it. Fair. Basement, dissection room, tailoring room, test room, dissection room. The last time I tried to cook something, the world was almost destroyed by the food monster. I wish Bennett didn't put his chemicals on the shelves along with the sugar on and the salt. One sitting, let's go. Soap obtained! Not even our dining room drawers have anything edible. This is so sad. It was... Might be useful. 
Look out for puppeteer symbols. Only the only the users with X in their names have access to all doors. Oh. Reward points is a save? Book a tr order food. Book a truth and soap. Okay. The puppeteers. This guy. Oh, okay. Those types. Seth type. Little type. Live in the true realm. Purpose. Control and direct. Assigned to humans only. It probably. NB. Can rewind time when the puppet dies. The observers. World government members. Where's animal mass? Known representatives. Umbrella man. The puppets, also known as humans, live in false realm. Purpose to earn known representatives. Me, mom, dad, classmates. Not so sure. The aliens. Huxley. <laughs> Pretend to be human to cause less ruckus and live in the false realm. Known as representatives. Huxley, Bennett, Aiden, politicians. Hmm. This is a big thing. Watch TV. It's a waste of time. Yes. Sure. Oh, 99 channel. So commercials 24/7. <laughs> what? A, what kind of hell is this? Next on pep. What the fuck? Panel Optican TV. Synth meal commercial. Don't miss it. Switch channels now. Enough TV for today. I agree. Wasn't locked yesterday. Access denied. Anarchist cookbook. Is this an Isaac reference? I'm such a. I'm so cringe. Kaboom! Advanced chemistry for explosive enthusiasts. Science fiction. Alamac 24. Uh, these are spinach shelves. They scream danger and geek. Fair. I. Fair. <laughs> Suing for everyone. Dressmaking made easy. Fancy folds. Art of the napkin folding. Aiden's bookshelf. I find it cute. The shelves are full of literature and alien language. I can't read the titles. The Nerd Lord. My Fair Salaryman. Astronaut Commando. This is Mother Shelf. She loves romance books. No, no, Yeah, thank you. How to disguise yourself as human. Oh, it's not that hard. He's gotta wear a mask. You know? Let's wear a mask. The Golden Apples of the Sun. Physics of the Impossible. One Hitman. My humble bookshelf. Oh, this is my bookshelf. Okay, cool. Let's order food. Hey, Charlie's Organic Junk Foods. Please place your order. Um, I'd like to order eco friendly chicken nuggets and an in instant diabetes. <laughs> <laughs> no, why would okay? So you want eco-friendly chicken nuggets, but you instantly want to get diabetes? Fair, fair. I mean, at least, at least you're eco-friendly to the chickens. You're not so concerned about yourself, but you're concerned about the chickens. I shouldn't be so nervous when talking to a machine. Thank you for ordering at Charlie's. They healthiest with us. Stay healthiest when I. Answer the door. Where's the door? Where is the door? Oh. Input magic word. <laughs> Please? What if I have to put in a question? Is there a question mark? There's an exclamation mark. 
I, s I said please. <laughs> Maybe, well, maybe I was streaming it. Hang on. Maybe if we ask in a more polite tone. What a nice girl. Access granted. I can't go, please. I gotta go, please. <laughs> Hallway. Oh, was that the note? I should have read the note. <laughs> A strange hissing noise is coming from behind the door. Want me to open it? No. The sounds are gone now. It should be safe. Lucky meal was found. I better return to the dining room. Feed Charlotte. Oh, do I just eat it now? What what mockery of real food? Is it all they can offer these days? Did you try wallpapers, dear child? They are especially rich in iron. And don't listen to them. Soap is much better in nutrition. Um, guys, do I get a say in this? Aliens don't really have a concept of personal space, do they? By the way, Mr. Aiden, the door to the ground floor or corridor it doesn't open. It's closed for minor construction works. Nothing to worry about. If you come out at night, you might find something interesting there. It impinches Bennett. Ow! <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? Wait. Did I say Aiden pinch Bennett? Or did, was that me monologuing to myself? Aiden pinches Bennett. Whatever. Stop giving the child weird ideas. Don't listen to him, dear girl. If you want to join in, I'll be watching SoapNet in the TV room. Soap operas just call for soap milkshakes. Depend oh, okay. We, we are RPing in our head. I almost forgot. Come to the dissection room later. I have a favor to ask of you. Okay. Find the basement key. He's watching SoapNet. What's two plus two? Fucking five. Can you prove that? <laughs> Four, of course. If you are free to make that statement, then it is correct. You, you may pass. <laughs> I wonder what would happen if I needed, if I opened the door. With that hissing noise. So at least the first four. Well, I, uh, maybe I need to go talk to my friend. This is Bennett, yeah? Yeah. Search for omnipotent cubes or multitask devices that allow transportation, duplication, creation, or disintegration of organic matter and the storage of that data. Please do not put liquid soap in the omnicubes, as it might be. Oh. Okay. I like Aiden. Aiden's cool. Round Forest Butler, you know, its hobbies include suing and. Oh. Cool. Now we should fight an army cube and. Yeah. Do I have to answer that every time? That took a long while. I thought the game crashed. <laughs> Open me. We must find out. 
and everything collapses into a singularity. Wait, what? I, I, uh, <laughs> I opened a box that had a black hole in it. Nice. That is very cool. It was a human once? Oh god, why why you decide to your corpse? Hi, Dr. Huxley. Hello, little Charlotte. How about that little talk we had earlier? Could you do me a favor of looking after my lovely nephew for a few, 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 couple days? Yeah. I've been so busy working on the cure for eye plague that I can't keep an eye on him for at all. For all I know, he could be collecting rare specimens in broad daylight right now. He's too passionate for his own good. Aren't you a little too passionate for your own for your own good yourself? The main reason why I'm worried about him, however, is that he has no sense of direction, you see. He may have had a bad attitude, but don't let that get to you. Okay, I'll help. Felix, come here! Ugh, I don't need anyone to look after me, Uncle Huxley. Right, right. I'll go play with your new big sister. Uncle has science to do. There he goes again. Hey, it's nice to meet you, Felix. I'm Charlotte. Hey. If you want to make it through the day, don't you dare invade my personal space. Well, I can almost feel him glare, his glare burning into my skin. This is going to be a long day. Kill time. Okay. The Umbrella Man. He appeared out of nowhere when I was a child. Whether I was in kindergarten or in the library with mom or alone in my room, he was always there, watching me with his yellow eyes from the dark, darkest corner of the room, not uttering a single word. When I tried to tell my mom about him, he lifted a finger to his lips, as if he wanted me to not, as if not wanting me to speak. So I didn't. In my book of truth, I call him the Observer. As soon as I def defined him, the man spoke for the first time. Hmm. Oh, that name is not bad, I must say, he remarked. However, won't anyone who watches over you become an observer? I had to agree. Hmm. Then I'll call you the Umbrella Man. Slightly taken aback, the man coughed. <laughs> Although I would have preferred a more euph euphonic name, let it stay this way. Since then, I gave... Every new person I met in the house had a distinctive name. Wow. The Umbrella Man 2. When Mom asked who I was talking to, I didn't tell her about the Umbrella Man. Instead, I told a lie. Well, that was it. My birthday. On the day of my 10th birthday, the doorbell rang in the middle of the night. A masked man wearing a top hat and a black suit was standing behind the door. Hello, little Charlotte, he said, with the smile of a man who offers children candies. That's not very safe. Mother told me not to talk to strangers, I said in a determined voice. He let out a sigh. Oh, I am no stranger to you. Human memory is so... <laughs> Big words. Ephemeral? Ephemeral. Ephemeral. Isn't it? Even if I... Even if I do know you, you must be a bad guy, I insisted. <laughs> Me bad? Why so? I had to come up with something. That's because all villains wear a top hat. Oh, is that so? What a silly prejudice. The man commented with a laugh. Don't let this appearance fool you. With those words, he took off the mask. As I thought, the man was none other than the Umbrella Man himself. Oh, although I'd love to stay and have a chat with you on your every day of the year, I came for another reason. I tilted my head and curious. Listen closely, little one. I came in to inform you that a puppeteer has been assigned to you since you've reached the age of ten. Who's that? They are representative of the true realm, designed specifically to watch over your troublesome species. The one assigned to you is a Seth-type puppeteer. As for their purpose, they are here to guide you, the puppets, throughout your short lives. Why would they do that? You see, little one, free will is fiction. Wow. Mm-hmm. 
I chewed on my words, trying to come up with some, with a smart reply. Ah, oh, this choice of words may have been too difficult for a child. Let me put it another way. Meet your new friend who will watch over you. Their name is Seth. <laughs> Don't bully them too much, okay? Don't tell me what to do. I'll do what I want. Do it yourself, heart massage, everything you do is but few, yeah. The selfish scheme about science, the man, <laughs> the man who mistook his wife for a hat. Oh, finally some books I've read. <laughs> Craving paper. <laughs> Embrace your inner pika. <laughs> the Alamac of official history. What to do if your daughter brings home uranium? That's a good question. Soap, soap Bible. So your son is an alien. How to raise your IQ by watching so- Oh god. <laughs> IQ stands for Impex Quotent? I what are these big words, dude? I, I like I already graduated high school, I don't need to I don't need to know big words. I'm stupid. Well, I'm sure that means, you know. Simpleton, rather, something like that. I don't know. The complete guide to conquering the universe. Four hundred, four hundred twenty-fifth fail proof edition. Fair. Cannibal man set free. Oh, that's not good. Human encyclopedia complete edition. Uh, doesn't human diseases to die from? Are human diseases deadly to you? Eh, actually, no. We can develop symptoms similar to human cold, though. Oh, okay. One door out of the three leads to death. Spooky. Blech. Well, I hope you enjoy the Monty Hall room. Open the door and die! Survive and get a prize. Wow, is this for real? Wanna check? Uh... Let's go with door number three! <laughs> nice. <laughs> Get smarter, nerd. Open door number one! Nothing happened. Two! Great. Wait, so if I open door number one, if I don't open door number three, does that kill me again? Oh, and that's a ribbon. Ah. What does that do? I don't know what that did. I feel like I wasn't supposed to use that. <laughs> wow. What's this squishy? A specimen for research and an organ supply. Look, but do not touch. Dang. Bloody. Wait here. Oh, okay. So this is where Bennett's crew works? Yeah, pretty much. Stuff usually blows up in here, so it had to be so it has to have restrictive access. <laughs> nice. User log. Shh, they're watching. Hmm. I've always considered a possibility of being watched. It's pretty possible if we take into account all the conspiracy theories. Baldwin. Archibald. No suit label? He's Goodwin. That's Lecter. Blanc? Franklin? Hello, Florence, what's up? We've discovered 
that adding dark matter to the dough improves the taste of chocolate cake by 15%. Dark matter, huh? I feel like that would be really dangerous, but okay. Don't tell anyone. Okie dokie. A tongue terror? This one's fake anyway. Nothing of interest inside. Tongue terror. Okay. What? Well, we killed time. Hello. Let's go kill more time in other places and things and stuff. It's in here. Oh. Oh. Oh, nice. Hi, Mr. Aiden. Being a busybody as always. Hello, dear girl. There's a dress I want you to try on, if you don't mind. I'd love to. I put on the dress. That, that, oh, oh! Look at that. How cute. Whoa, it's totally rad! Yeah. <laughs> totally rad. I wasn't expecting the word rad to come up, but yeah. It's called White Spotted Jellyfish Dress. It still needs finishing tussers. I'll give you I'll give it to you when it's ready. Thanks, Mr. Aiden. Simple black and white dress. Wanna try it on? <laughs> what do you Oh, I'm asking him <laughs> Do you wanna try it on? <laughs> what do you take me for? A dress up doll? Polka dot dress. Another polka dot dress. A pretty dress. This is prettier than the one next to it. Polka dot dress. Yet another polka dot dress. Aiden loves order. Even if his mannequins are in place. Hmm. So. Okay. Knowing this kind of game, it's going to be like, haha, you got to memorize the puzzle. Hmm. Oh, I guess we're going outside. I don't want to disturb my neighbors. What's this door? It doesn't say anything about neighbors, but okay. Wonder where this door leads to. You and your curiosity. Fine, I'll open it. Wow. Whoa, we're in outer space. Satisfied. Yep. Oh god. Found something inside, but uh, better not. I took it anyway. We're gonna save. Wait, did I? Was I supposed to? T hmm. This is big thing. Bon appetit. What's up, my man? You can watch TV. Bennett looks sad. Why is Bennett sad? Hi, Bennett. Are you dead or something? After uh, 1,037 episodes and 10 specials, they finally confessed their undying love to each other. Underneath my protection suit, I'm dying from complex feelings. <laughs> Let's leave him until he's ready to return to the harsh reality, shall we? Sure, why not? Yeah, I'm doing alright. But why? What? I'm going to sleep. Well, Base 6 is going to sleep. How about you? Uh, I do not require sleep. I'll grab a bottle of soap and measure your brain waves while you sleep, stupid human. Sounds like a plan. I don't suppose that I have to accompany you to the bathroom. No way in hell. Go to sleep already. And good night. Well, it's time to sleep. I guess. Well, I'm off to bed. Good night. Good night, Seth. Am I Seth? Something slimy crawls into the room? 
Oh, it's just my magnet cat. <laughs> One day, my cat turned to a maggot. Or was he a maggot all along that turned into a cat? Eh. The mad cat stays as it makes itself comfortable on my bed. Aww. Good, good cat. Charlotte pets the mad cat. It purrs. Charlotte falls asleep peacefully. Aww. How nice. Wow. What was that sound? Who's who pro promised to come back soon, too? Did they get lost in the house? I bet we go look for him. Consider taking pepper spray. A flamethrower would be more effective, don't you think? <laughs> it sure would. It sure would.
don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Uh. Wow, well, I get shot again. <laughs> I thought that'd be something cool, but whatever. All right, whatever. <laughs> no, you freaking! Oh god, this is okay. <sighs> god damn it! Oh my god, that was really close. Okay, we're gonna save right here because I'm tired of running. Uh oh. Aha! I wonder where that bear went. A back door key? Some vegetables, some pots. Uh, a sink. It's an oven. Actually. The little girl's eyes well up with the tears of the sight of Starlet. Um, I'm very sorry. Can I help you somehow? Are you lost? Aren't you lost yourself, big sister? Did that hurt? Leave. Freya doesn't talk to strangers. Fair. A bears and men. Nothing of interest. The lovely honey. The bear factory. I don't trust. <laughs> you don't need one. That's just cute. That's not good. That might not be good. The girl's eyes light up at the side of the rabbit toy. Want me to give it to you? I can have it? Sure, here you go. Thank you. Your eyes look like white eggs. I'll take that as a compliment, I guess. I'm looking for a little boy. He must have lost his way in this place, too. Have you seen my engines? No. There's no one but Freya. I see. You must be very lonely. <laughs> Freya is fine on her own anyway. Get lost if you're not going to stay. Oh. oh, more bears. The bear of the key shall pass. I don't like this music. It's it's, it's creeping me out. It's it's gonna be on high tense. Take a break. I don't. I don't trust. I don't trust like that. Oh, bear room. It can move at any second. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna grab this and it's gonna. Oh. oh hey, they have the 20. Uh, can we take it, please? Listen, we didn't come here for treasure hunting. You're so boring. <laughs> Fine. The door's closed. Oh, hey, a cat! Don't drink from the right cup. Don't drink from the left cup. Well, I mean... Cats do not tell lies. Enter the right fireplace? 
Uh, who do I believe? Go inside. Nice. <laughs> Burn to death. <laughs> but of course. So we enter the left fire. Go in. The fire embraces me. Oh, okay. Burn to death again. I mean. <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe we have to drink first. Don't drink from the right cup. Don't drink from the left cup. Drink it. I feel dizzy. Let's do both.
oh. <laughs> You'll go, oh. Not this again. Oh, God. The default clock sound. Who doesn't? You, oh. Um. Sit on the chair. No. No! Let me read the freaking. Eat the porridge. Oh. Guns are heavy. Oh, it's one of these tales, huh? Once upon a time, there lived three bears, a little, small, wee bear, a middle-sized bear, and a great, huge bear. It's... it's this... Oh, sorry, huh? Each had a porridge bowl, a chair, and a bed. They were honest, good-natured, trusting bears. One day, a girl came into their house. She could not have been good on... She could not have been a good, honest little girl. For first, she peeped in a keyhole, and seeing nobody inside, she lifted the latch. I know how the Three Bears story ends, do you? Um... The bear killed the intruder, the intruder killed the bears? Um... Well, I'm pretty sure the girl... In the modern version, I'm pretty sure the girl gets caught? But I'm sure the bears kill the intruder as, you know... Now she left through the window, but we're not in a fairy tale. Yeah. Sleep on the bed. If she had been a good girl, she would have waited for the th bears to invite her into the house, for they were good bears. But she was rude. Bad, bad little girl. Silver key, nothing of interest in here. I'm sure if I sit, I'm going to die. Oh. Only forward. Oh. Oh, I used the key. Yeah. Here. There's something in this room? I wouldn't be so sure about that. Or is there? You are a little burglar, oh god. Choose the room you will wait your punishment in. Um <clears throat> Lion Room. That lions haven't eaten for a long time. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> wait, what did I save? Ah, <laughs> It's fine. The door isn't open. Uh oh. Oh, I need to interact with this over here, huh? I'm assuming the curtains are heavy. Uh, the 
hearts are heavy, but I have the key. Wait, did I not pick up the key? No, I did. choose the other rooms torture room this it can't get any worse right oh so by torture they didn't mean that I'd be tortured there this room doesn't look any different from the others though oh wow <laughs> what's wrong Seth I'm having a pro with the program does it mean I, I can do what I want? No, I simply can't access the rewind menu. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, well, that's not good. No turning back. Oh, I have to do save points now, huh? I don't like that. Logic error. Oh, a person? Felix? You? Oh, Kim, I found you! Don't worry, Big Sis is here to help. I can't, I can't breathe. Stop this irrational display of affection this instant. Small talk aside, how'd you get in here? I, uh, got lost in your house. Uh, there's no way I'm buying that. Anyhow. Uh, we need a plan. I'm not going to sit around and wait until the bears use us for crappy taxidermy. The bears? What are you talking about? Are you captured by them too? Excuse me? I just got here and I have no clue what you're talking about. Anyhow, you really needn't follow have followed. Do you even have any weapons on you at all? Only books. Seth is against violence. I'm not actually. I'm very... I'm very. If it's in a game, I'm, I'm all for it, but... This isn't a fairy tale. So we're gonna, yeah. Please excuse me while I slam my hand against, against my hand against my forehead. Good thing we met up before you could get into more trouble. Fine, fine, I get it. So, sorry for being a burden. Well, there's nothing we can do about it now. Still, what are you doing here? Well, there's a high probability of an oracle who had taken phys physical form appearing in, the, in this dimension. There's a, such an occurrence happens once in several millenniums. An oracle? What's that? For you, they are equal to gods. In short, they are entities capable of creating small universes. I won't go into detail for now. It's not like your peeny brain would comprehend it at all. Yeah, they sound like fun. What's this? Security drone, presumably. This one seems broken. Aw. Found something nice. Take it. Take it. BMG change. <laughs> well, I mean, great change of pace. Found something nasty. Take it. Oh, no, they're asked for living. Take it! Gasp! Made all drones deadly! Oh. <laughs> That's not good. Soap. You can't shoot us all. No, but I can shoot you. <laughs> no!
It's playing even in the menu. Wow. <laughs> Obtain black hole? What? No! Uh. Oh, uh, well, I. Okay. This music is much more, um. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Doodles? What are doodles? Extra art? From Etherane. Bottle of soap. All drones deadly. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Playing fire right now. <laughs> Glad I saved. <laughs> There's nothing, okay. Hall of Ignorance, enter? No. <laughs> oh, answer the question. Nine. <laughs> what? We enter the Hall of Ignorance. Nice. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh boy. They are always watching, fair. No. Knock knock! Ah! Question number four. Do you of an E5? That's just unfair. <laughs> Too easy. The answer is zero. And I'm dead. Question number one. Uh oh. So th the first one is three. The tiny god. The tiny god created a tiny universe filled with tiny people. The tiny people created more tiny people and tiny things. <clears throat> Engaged in tiny wars and became tiny piles of dust. Happy end. Oh god. So it's three and then it's, uh so it's three something something zero. Unless it changes. I don't think it changes. Yeah. I hate this so much. Did you 
save after? Yeah, I did. <laughs> Actually, I could just... I feel no shame in doing this. Imagine if it was three, two, one, zero. We're gonna be here for a while. I do not fear the judgment. I think I should kill you after a number of times, but that's just me. This one. Effect. Oh, okay. Whoops. <laughs> Dramatic snow effect. I'm not schizophrenic, just multi. F f uh, okay. Multi. multi f f f f f made all drones deadly there's nothing in the box this box is surprisingly open it found a doorknob cool we did it open the door So close, right, left, up, up, left, right, up. So closed, right, left, up, up, left, right, up. Left, right, up, up, left, right. Okay, so after going left once and then right once, you go up twice, left and right again, and then up once. I would think. Too bad. Wait. Okay, hold up. I thought it'd be like a maze puzzle. Okay, hold up. Oh! 
Oh, okay. So it's I'm trying to figure out what what it means. <laughs> Start bottom left. Oh, okay. So th three, one. Up. Yeah, 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 yeah. So start the bottom left. It's uh, we go. So oh, it's one up. Okay. Left up, right up, right up, left. That's confusing as fuck. <laughs> So, okay, it's three, one, two, two, three, one, two, two, three, one, two, two, one, three, one, two. That's, yeah, okay. So, three, one, two, two. I, I'm having I, I, numbers is hard to memorize. Three one two two. One three one two. Fuck. <laughs> three one two two, and then I completely forget the other room. Three one two two. One three one two. Okay. Oh, it saves it. Oh, then I, I don't need to remember. Uh, one, three, one, two. One, three, one, two. One, three, one, two. Congratulations. Did I just die? <laughs> what? His head gone. This can't be can't we do something it's it's no use no matter what you do he'll end up dying here one way or another who are you the four-eyed person lets out a laugh <laughs> stop making that face it doesn't suit you i'm a librarian but you see nobody comes to read anymore anyhow there's no use crying over dead meat oh could you i promise to look after him yet and there there not all sauce aside from this person's head, I guess. Oh, wait, wait, don't hit me for that. What, uh, what do you suggest I do, then? Switch the channel. That's all. How would that help me? You'll see for yourself. Perhaps you'll get lucky enough to change history. Why should I trust you? I'm not telling you to... Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Dang. I'm not telling you to do something unthinkable, am I? Besides, I'm quite knowledgeable about this. how this place works. Oh, sorry, I'm quite enjoying myself too much. It's the first time I've talked to anyone in person, an actual person in years. The door's open. Why don't, aren't you in a hurry? Right. Goodbye then. Bye bye. Be careful if you meet the executioners on your way. They won't be nice like me. Dang. Hmm. This channel doesn't work. Hmm. Try to switch to the channel.
the Hall of Knowledge. Oh, I can explore in here more. Felix? You? Is it really you? What kind of question is that? Of course it's me. I just got here. Is that so? Hey, why are you crying? Hug the ban! Oh my gosh, that smile and those eyes, those eyes with that smile. That does not look like someone who is relieved to see the person alive. That looks like someone who's gone fucking insane. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, stop that. Charlie, let's go. I'm so glad you're safe and sound. Felix sighs. Is that so? Anyhow, you don't have to follow me. It's my duty to look after you, dummy. Don't underestimate, underestimate me and my amazing caretaker skills. Thought you were going to scold me for running off. You came here for a reason, right? I won't scold you. Just stay safe. Okay, I guess. You're acting weird. You're imagining things. Take my hand so we won't get separated, okay? Absolutely unnecessary. No objections allowed, as Seth likes to say. Did that book just... Princess passed through the fields, admiring how fruitful they were, and the crops got soaked in ink. The princess swam in the sea, admiring how fast and clear it was, and all fish died from pollution. Please leave these lands. Can't you see everything is dying? The peasants begged the princess. But the ink princess was deaf to their prayers, as her heart had been soaked in ink a long, long time ago. No matter where the ink princess went, she was always unwelcome. Sad. Well, I suppose we can just go back. This is the first time I've had to solve puzzles in order to open a door. Ridiculous. This box is full with junk. Lift it. Let's lift it instead. Found a doorknob. Oh, okay. Hmm. Will he just die again? I should save, actually. Let me save real quick. It's just an endless cycle of... of dying over and over and over again. Ooh. No, no, touch it. Why are you acting so cautious all of a sudden? We've been here once before. I switched the channel and switched the channel. What does that mean? I don't think I quite understand myself. After doing that, I came back to the exact same place, but something's changed. Like what? Like you're still alive. Did I die right here? Your head got cut off. Uh oh, what should we do then? I'll go first. Seth can rewind if I die before my expiration date. Besides, I can't afford losing you again. That's just stupid. It's the only way out. Yup. Three, one, two, two. Um, one, three, one, two. Wrong pass. Oh, fuck. One, three, one, two. One, three, one. Wait. Wait, what? One, three, one, two. Wait, did the password change? Or am I just stupid? Three, one, two, two. Did the password change? The password changed. Okay. So we're uh, okay. So it's one three two two. Three one two one. So it's one three two two. 
me go back and look again. Three, one, two, one. Three, one, two, one. Three, one, two, one. Have a nice day. Hey, cool. Inner TV. Hey, that's pretty cool. Is that T I see in chat? Fucking. What a guy. Oh, hey. Go in? Of course. I love to die. No way out. Just says you. Space of gore? Uh, this is, okay. Sick a noodle in the eye? The sword's glaring at me. Yo. The fuck is this? Space of abundance? The door won't open. D what is this fucking <laughs> black space ass? Space of happiness? Sure. What the fuck? Do I die if I touch one of these? I very much so do. <laughs> Why did I save in there? Door! Oh, flower ladies. My biggest fears are meat and pomegranates? Pomegranates? Meat is red, violets are blue. Flowers that tell lies have bad memory. Sure? You'd be so kind as to bring me the contents of the of the black box. The green box. The blue box. Let's go in here. The space of gore. Whoa. Look at them dance. I don't trust you. Go away. The fire lady ignores us. Sad. That's <laughs> really trippy to look at. Oh, I can block them. Good lord. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> that scared fucking screw. Happening right now. <laughs> why is this? Why is such loud screaming? <laughs> you know, move. This one just doesn't know what to do with itself. What am I supposed to be doing here? Do I kill all of them or...? Dude, the screams are just... awful. <laughs> Thank you. 
I'm so confused. What the fuck? Okay. So they wanted the black and the blue. No. Oh, I don't. I don't trust that. <laughs> I don't trust that one bit. We're gonna save and we're gonna go over here and open up the blue box. Lying flowers. Nice. The black box, and uh, what about this one? Fair. <laughs> Oh, well, the red one said shred of, like, meat. So maybe red? Fancy. <gasps> meat! <laughs> Run! <laughs> Hello? Is the meat gone? The meat is gone. What about the yellow box? Is that... that does indeed kill me. Fair. Meat, 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 meat. Okay. Space of happiness? More like... Bleh. Hello? The yellow box... The oh, why thank you. Here, you can have my old-fashioned bros. I don't need it anymore. We can use that pin to attach it to something. Oh, a pin? A pin, you say? Get away from the door, you fuck. There we go. Stick a needle in the eye like a big pizza pie. That's... Cross your hope, uh, cross your heart, and hope to die. Stick a needle in the eye like a big pizza pie. The Whoa. eye bleeds like a more. Cool. Beware of the third eye. Is this the third eye? The door's closed shut. Fair. Put a friend unit one PCs in the incinerator and push the on button. A friend unit? We go. Oh. Just kidding. Get another cliche. I thought there'd be any volunteers. To pass forth, dispose of your friend. Oh. Uh, what if I put Felix? What if I. Oh. Oh, oh god, Gouge just the eye out. Uh, what the fuck is this maze? What is that background? That is terrifying. Yeah. A medical scissors. Okay.
Oh boy. Navigating through a maze with things that can kill you is super fun. Oh boy. Oh, mazes and f are fun. Mazes are super fun. Uh. There ain't nothing there. There ain't nothing there. Ain't nothing there. Ain't nothing here. Oh, hey, a save point. Oh, and an exit. Oh, it's upside down. So, middle... So, middle... Middle... Then we took a left, and then back up. Okay. I'm assuming we would have died uh, any other way. Oh, uh, this is trippy. That one leads to nowhere. Hmm. He's all right. You're cheating me up again, huh? I know this is part of your job, but you do it nevertheless. Thank you, Seth. It's my pleasure. Ooh. So what? We're supposed to like go back? Are we supposed to go back? No, I don't know. I don't think we're supposed to go back. We need to keep exploring. Maybe we are wasting time by being here. Who knows? I feel like we're about to get trapped in an endless loop. Yeah. All right, fine. We can go back, I guess. <laughs> that, that would be, that would happen, wouldn't it? All right. So what, we just head back the way we came or something? If I can remember the way that I came. Felix is in here. Oh no. Donde esta, Felix? Oh. The door is half open. Open the door? Not yet. Not yet. We're gonna save. Alright, now we can open the door. <laughs> oh, 
I see. That's... Hmm. Little Peter Rabbit had a fly upon his nose. Sure did. Oh. Hey, hi, that's... Yeah. I've always wondered what rabbits have inside their bellies. I am this surprised. It wasn't cotton. <laughs> no! Why? That was too late. The girl approaches me, leaving the boy like a toy she had lost interest in. Why, hello, dear guest! The girl touches my cheek with her blood-soaked hand. Why are you so sad? Does it hurt anywhere? Come here. I'll sing you a Get Better song. Pain, pain, go away. Don't come back another day. I choose third run. What about Felix? We must leave without him. Over my dead body. Step out of it. He's not even a person. What are you saying? Uh, I get it. He says switch the channel. To make everything right. Hey, who are you talking to? There's no one but me. The very next moment, the girl looks at me as if she's seeing me for the first time. Let's play hide and seek. I'll close my eyes and count to 60. Make sure you find a good place to hide. Or else, you're it. One, two. Uh-oh. This isn't good. Good. Where do I go? I'm so dead. There's no place to hide. Where are you? I don't know if you got a life. Please. Please come over. She just. Are you. I'm begging you. Oh my god. Are you out of your mind? Can't you see? It's a bad end for me. Unless you read my time down another way. So, if Sister's Felix gave to me, you know what to do. What? Do it! Okay, I'm um, probably it's afternoon tea time. The meat is not yet rotten, but the body is hollow. Ugh. Mm. Yet another unsightly death. This is no good. Don't no, worry, you've led the girl to the wrong path, but you've completely lost control of her actions and manipulated and been manipulated by her. I cannot congratulate you on such an embarrassment of an ending. <laughs> Deeply sorry for my inappropriate behavior as a puppeteer. <laughs> I request you grant me another chance. That's quite the bold request, my dear boy. I'll grant it, however. Death can be rather amusing. Try as many times as you like. Oh, we're back. Wait! Uh, uh... Wait. Oh. 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 Well, I feel like we've been here before. How about one of us goes to check what's ahead? Oh, wait here. You're not going alone, of course. My puppeteer will be with you. Uh, yeah, sure. Hate this just in case. So, okay. I go. No, Felix goes instead of Charlotte. Will that just lead to a similar sort of ending? I feel like that's not the wisest decision. 
this. Okay. Then when I check out Charlotte. Oh, hello! Hmm. Hello there. Isn't it dangerous for a little girl to wander around here all alone? I'm waiting for my friends to come back to my side. Is that so? Well, it's a pity they won't make it back before you, you meet your death in 10 minutes. That'd be bad. Seth will get fired if I die without him by my side. Is that all there is to it? I don't want to cause anyone any trouble. Well, well, aren't you a nice child? But Felix, will he be okay? I'm afraid he'll die shortly after. There is only one way to save your friend, however. Must man with something to char Charlotte. Well, is that okay? Got it. Even though you disagree with my methods? It's the only way to save him, right? I'm too weak to do anything alone. The man pets Charlotte's head. Don't blame yourself for a single thing, child. Well then. Um... Am I... I'm supposed to head back, yeah? There's no point in staying here. No going back for now. Oh, okay, fine. I guess I have to keep on going. Uh, but Charlotte's gonna... Die! I'm only wasting my time here. Guide me back. Please. Sure, just a moment. Ah, uh, the body, the human body is such a fragile thing. I can't just apologize if I accidentally break it yet, can I? Well then, what do we have here? Hmm. All this junk is no good. Scissors? Not bad, but not the best option either. It's a shame. I'll get this dirt, pretty dress dirty. Hi! Do you want to play hide and seek with me and my friends? You see, I'm really bored. That's right. Let's play a game. Boredom's the worst, isn't it? <laughs> Open your eyes. Here come the scissors. Uh-oh. <laughs> Is... Is... Oh. Did... Did... Did I just get possessed and killed this... Oh. Oh no. Who's this person? What was I? I just had to chill to make everything alright. Right? Hey. Oh. Wow. That's... Don't make me a murderer. Oh dear. Oh, I almost just died. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Let's head back to my good friend Charlotte. Charlotte isn't here. Charlotte isn't here. You mean you? No! Charlotte? Felix! Seth! Here you are. Good thing you're safe and sound. Are you hurt anywhere? And what in the world are you stuffing into the incinerator? Uh, the blood isn't mine. While you're away, I figured I'd stuff the meat chunks we saw earlier in here. Is that so? Are you alright? Yeah, sorry for worrying. Sorry for worrying you. Jeez, I, I had, I was more, I, I was worried about you. But here, here where you are, covered in blood, more obnoxious and more, more obnoxiously cheerful than ever. Well, sorry about that. Wait, you were worried about me? That's something new. You make it sound like I'm a jerk. <laughs> well, thank you for trusting me, Seth. You truly are a friend. I'm a puppeteer, not a friend. Yeah, yeah, I got it. 
Then you're the best puppeteer ever. Let's go, everyone. Oh. Ooh. It's open. Charlotte? Hey, are you really alright? You are spicing up. It's nothing. Fire. Fine. You don't have to tell me what happened. Here, take my hand. Take hand. Charlotte takes Felix's hand. She's shaking. Aww. Poor child. Poor, poor child. Hey, Felix? Yeah? Can you tell me more about what we were looking for? I don't know as far as you, but I'll try to understand. Well, all I know is that the person... The, the, the per people here are called... The Sias? The th Pythias. Pitu, putu, putu, yeah. They were created by an oracle. Whom they call their god. At least, used to. Pythias are extremely powerful. They can alter reality to their will, which most likely resulted in a different dimensions being created. From what I gathered, every species perceived them differently. Otherwise, they wouldn't look so, uh, so human? Right. To you. Last time I visited there were much more... Last time I visited there were, there were much more of them, yet we barely met anyone on our way. This place is a mess. It wasn't supposed to be like this. Perhaps something bad happened. Oh boy! Contamination warning. Organic tissue ahead. Ugh, that's blood. Okay. We are in blood. No! Great. A dead python. Poor thing. Another dead body. It's not moving. They all look the same. We probably look the same to them as well, you know. There's so many of them. Slaughterhouse 1? Slaughterhouse 2? Well, let's go in Slaughterhouse 1! Enjoy the vacation with style. Bone saw. It's always here when you need it the most. Comes with two blades. Cool. We're not taking that. Oh, it could come in handy, though. <laughs> Kids these days. I can almost hear you sighing from the other side of the control console. Ways to find out if your neighbor is possessed by God. Well, shoot him and see what happens. Fair, you know? That... Yeah! She is us. We are her. Yes. Oh, we can continue... Okay. Slaughterhouse 3 third there's only in these rooms only the corpses another dead body dead <laughs> wonder what happened here that's a good question a rotting corpse she's just sleeping nah she's gone <gasps> what the fuck <laughs> Shit! We, uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> hmm. Crazy. The door won't open. Slaughterhouse 4. Okay, I need a code. It's it's a fin. The second, the fourth, first. Oh. 
Oh, that's a nine. So... So four, nine, this one's a one. So four, nine, blank one. We could always cheat again. Oh yeah, we can. Four, nine, pretty sure it was eight. Or no, four nine, yeah, yeah. I remember seeing that in one room. It was the corpse. It was it looked like an eight. Fire mask obtained. Get one today for free. Executioner mask. What's the cute in execute? An absolute must have for all ladies and gentlemen. How do I look? Rather menacing. <laughs> Put the Q in and execute. I like that. The door won't open. So I go back here, and everyone. Yay! Now they aren't angry. See, I bet I would have. Yeah, I probably would have died. <laughs> There's second notes on the table. Eight three seven five two nine eight three seven five two nine. Oh. Eight three seven five two nine. 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 Cool. Everyone is born to execute. Christmas morning, you will be happier with a shotgun. Why is everyone obsessed with murder? An all-family adventure. God, hun. Television room. The door is locked. Become an executioner today! Sign up for the God Hunt by calling us. Feeling oppressed? Your life is a wreck? You did nothing wrong! Get your revenge by joining the God Hunt today. Why are air powered guns for an unforgettable fun experience? Wiseman gun. Barrels of fun. Yeah. When you can't sleep, don't count, sheep. C count on your tame chainsaw. Okay. Oh, so that's how they betray the oracle here. She's beautiful. Just for your information, oracles do not have physical form nor gender. The one protected here is no more than a young priestess. Yeah. Pythonian princess. Fight for equality. Nah. I think I heard something behind the door. Oh, it's not executioners. Right now we are executioners, remember? Yes! Uh oh. One of the dismembered bodies is moving. She's still alive! Well, hello, well, hello, dear executioners. You're so tiny, yet you're the ones who came to end the life of our last child. How ironic. Come forth and swing your blade. Don't make us wait any longer. Um, I'm very sorry, but we won't harm you anyway. You won't. How come? Well, for starters, we're not one of your kind. We, got, we take off the mess. The girl extends her weak hands to my face. Just two eyes. You are merely a traveler. Um, am I missing something? Hush. We are speaking to the to a real oracle, the creator of all that exists in this universe. This body is just a dying vessel. It's an honor to meet you. You seem like a good child. We believe... We've known your parents once. Uh, the girl coughs up blood. You should leave these lands, for we do not have much too much time left. What about this girl? 
she could no longer be saved. But we... we wish to be with our children until the very end. They are only corpses. We should leave, Charlotte. Right. Will we meet again? Seek and you shall find. I'd say we should put our mask on, but you know, whatever. Hey, never mind. We're fine. Cool. Well, looks like there's only one channel left. Somehow I feel. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like I'm. There's an echo in the room. <laughs> somehow, I f somehow I feel it'll be the last year we visit. Well, it might be not maybe far from the truth. Well then, let's go. I feel like I have to apologize for what many things, running away, putting you in danger, making you come here. I found what I was looking for. Yet I feel no satisfaction at all. I didn't have the slightest idea what might happen in this place. I still don't. I thought Uncle would recognize my achievements if I wrote on pa paper. If I wrote a paper on the oracles, a phenomenon and entity, yet this oracle and their universe freak of death. That was 20 billion years too late. You must, th you must be thinking how meaningless this journey was. Feel free to laugh at me. Hug him! <laughs> it's okay. Please stop blaming yourself. Isn't everything in our life pretty much meaningless? We're so tiny, aren't we? Like worms or even maggots. Yet we consider ourselves important and do everything to benefit ourselves. Isn't that what's laughable? Besides, I like going on adventures with you. For me, it's like being with a friend. <laughs> what's with that pseudo-intellectual monologue? Don't try to seem smarter than you are, human maggot. Aren't we already friends? If you say so. <laughs> what are we looking for? Uh, what are we looking for? What are we waiting for? Let's go in. What are we looking for, anyway? Oh, God! <laughs> applause, applause. Welcome, welcome, dear guests. We were waiting for you. Now we can finally have a talk. Well, then, did you enjoy the show? Was it not to your liking? The show? Oh, of course, all the worlds you visited. There used to be an infinite number of channels, you know. Now they've turned into mere recordings of their past glory. If I may ask, what happened to this world? Many, many things. A long time ago, we used to be called a god, although we were never were one. Our own children raised a knife against us. We used to have thousands of hands, yet they cut all of them off, and now we are powerless. So loud. Turn that down a little bit. <laughs> we used to observe the world with billions of eyes, yet they gouge out every single one, and now we are blind. We used to walk in leaps and bounds through the worlds we created, yet we are no longer take a single step as our legs were taken away. The creation we dearly loved, regardless of their deeds, destroyed themselves, and now we are alone, yet we forgave them for their sins. And we forgive you. You see, the universe we've created is dying. Nothing exists anymore. All we can do is indulge in the memories of the past. No matter how distorted they are, soon we will fall apart. So this land and those walking on it. That would be troubling. We absolutely ha have to return home by tomorrow morning. Well, there is a way, human child. Do you wish to try? Yes! Input error. What do I have to do? Put your hands on the screen, would you? You sure about this? Oh, well, there's no other way we can leave. Didn't you hear the oracle? <laughs> you would not listen to me either way, would you? Even though I don't want to cause trouble for anyone in the end, I'm quite a trouble per troublesome person, aren't I? Put my hands on the screen. The oracle? No. The god of this world put their palms to match mine on the other side of the screen. I can only vaguely remember what happened next. I accepted the god into my heart, and we walked home hand in hand. Every, everything that I became her, everything that she was, became a part of me. 
Together we say goodnight to the dying world. All the life, the planets, the stars, the black holes, even the atoms have ceased to exist. One by one, the channel switched off. Oh. Such, such a nice, you know, cinematic scene. You know, I take in a literal god into me, and then the world just begins to fade away, and then cuts to watching TV. <laughs> the Oracle used my body as a vessel and used up all the remaining power she had to bring us home. Thanks to that, we were able to make it back home safely. While we were away, I had a second pass in our world. And that was quite a story, my dear. You personally made an Oracle, even a dying one. What great luck you've run into. Well, who would have known? Do you always have to wear this creepy mask when you see me? I know you're using Father's body as a container to talk to me anyway. Easy with a tongue, dear. I thought it would be inconsiderate of me to have a chat with you while using someone you know as a vessel, but if you insist. The umbrella man takes his mask off. <gasps> ah, it's, it's, Adorable. Better now? Yep, much better. Your eyes have such a pretty collar. Say, Umbrella Man? Hmm? Do you happen to know the person I met in the Tiva world? Why are you so sure that there was anyone there at all? Well, that's because I committed an unimaginable sin, yet I only vaguely remember it, as if I watched it from the other side. Your naivety never ceases to amuse me. Of course, we had to edit your source code shortly after you came back. I can't tell the truth, can I? <laughs> You're talking as if we're in a video game. Most worlds are code-based, my dear. As you say. Why would you do that? And those memories are very unnecessary. Remember, we do not want you to fail your education program. Sorry you messed up the you, even enough <laughs> with an oracle becoming a part of you. I'm sure Mr. Seth would greatly would be greatly upset if you two go around causing havoc when he isn't looking. We both know I'm not like that, sir. Amen. By the way, I, I, I'm rather surprised that you you were able to contain a godlike entity without all of your life supporting systems collapsing. Probably because she was too weakened to do that much damage to my body. Hmm. What has become of them now? She's still sleeping. I wish we had talked more. Even after seeing her memories, I still don't know much about her. The oracles, what are they, really? One could compare them to stars, reaching the end of their lives. They gradually lose all their power and become infantile white dwarfs. Think of yourself, would a god capable of creating new life from zero care for such insignificant beings like you? Are you talking to me right now? Aren't you talking to me right now? No, are you talking to me? <laughs> a good one. Well, isn't that great that you've met a new friend? Now take your pills and go to sleep. Wouldn't want you to nod off in your in your lessons, although they would postpone your employment status. <laughs> thanks for finding a uh, thanks for finding an hour to spend with me. Good night, Mr. Umbrellman. Good night, little Charlotte. Receive pills. I'm off to sleep then. I sleep well. Try to take pills first. I still have the code. Took the pills. Uh oh. Wow. It's much more flushed out. Uh oh. Huh. Is her room gonna look really nice? Ah, it's a cat! Hi, Mac Cat. Bear! Bear! Gee! Oh, a teddy bear. Take the toy. It's time to sleep. 
Uh, I wonder if I'll see space, especially in my dreams. Oh, there's Seth. Good night, Charlotte. I hug my rabbit toy. Oh, Felix! Oh no! It's Felix. Good night, Felix. Good night, Umbrella Man and Oracle. Good night, Guardian Angel who watches over me. Hello, Charlotte. Episode 1 Junk Food, Gods, and Teddy Bears. End. Thank you for playing. I hope you enjoyed playing this game as much as I enjoyed making it. See you in the next episode. Episode 2! Yeah! <laughs> And that's episode one of Hello Charlotte. <laughs> yeah. Fix that. Oh man. And oh man. Ah, oh, what a fun game. Ooh, and there's only more to explore after with Hello Charlotte Episode 2 and Episode 3 Hello Charlotte Childhood. Which is going to be pretty cool. Whenever I play it. <laughs> Which will probably be sometime next week. Because tomorrow is War Ender Lilies. And I'm going to enjoy suffering more, so. <laughs> That'll be fun. Oh boy. Alright. Hello Charlotte kind of reminds me of, um, oh, what's the game? Light Eat, which I do have. Oh, I guess Alice Mare too. I actually played Alice Mare on, um, my gaming channel a long time ago. But yeah, Light Eat. It, it, I, it's kind of like Hello Charlotte, it, well, not really. It, Hello Charlotte's more... <laughs> In the darker realms, but light eats more, you know. It has the same style and aesthetic, I guess. Um, or it has the. Uh, you've never played either of those. Uh, Alice Mare, I, I, I honestly really enjoyed Light Eat um, the best. Um, it's similar to um, Hello Charlotte, and it has I think three episodes, but yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. I really enjoy, um, yeah, the uh, classic RPG Maker games. Yeah, the f <laughs> Black Space. Yeah, I, that was really cool. You know, I really, I really enjoy the creepy aesthetic. I didn't enjoy the bears though, the bears sucked, but <laughs> everything else was pretty cool about it. It was a bit short, of course, I mean, it, I mean, it's only episode one, um, about two hours, you know, I mean, there's still more episodes to be had as well, you know, so that'll be fun. I'll be sure to stream those as well. But if you're ever interested in watching like a game similar to that, oh, do I even ha do I have Light Heat uploaded, or is it, do I just have Alice Mare? Going to my channel playlists. Really, uh, yeah. Good old. The light eat. It, 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 Alice Mare is uh, similar, in, uh, you know, in that it's a classic RPG maker game. 
I really enjoyed it. Uh, I played this back in, oh god, January 29th of 2017. <laughs> Check that out, good luck. <laughs> so if you want to watch 2017 me, I mean, hey, feel free. Ah. Oh. I'm really sad I didn't play any, um, Light Eat Eat, uh, though. That makes me kind of saddened, but... Yeah. Gosh, uh, <laughs> My poor old gaming channel. Now it's just filled with a bunch of Isaac content. <laughs> and, uh, fucking... Old, uh, old games that I used to play. I used to play Plague Inc. I used to play Undertale. I used to play Undertale freaking, um... <laughs> fan games i used to go to like uh what is it game jolt and just download those kind of games yeah i have a playlist for those as well don't i oh the undertale no history undertale fan made games yeah and the underfail Oh, I remember Undertale Yellow. Undertale Yellow was such a good, 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 good game. Honestly, out of all these, I think Undertale Yellow is probably the best one. <laughs> if Underpants got more fleshed out, I feel like it'd be pretty cool too, but... Last Breath, yeah. Ugh. Looking back on my old channel. <laughs> oh, good stuff. I used to actually upload uh, music scores as well. It was good fun. Gosh, I thought I did a lot more stuff on my uh, gaming channel than I did. I did a whole bunch of CSGO stuff. They were really shit videos. <laughs> like, look at these thumbnails, legit or nah. What the fuck? So, yeah, so cringy, dude. So cringy. I will say the Portal 2, Portal 2 co-op let's play with um, Faulty Inertia was really good. If I were to recommend any of my videos, it would be the Portal 2 co-op. Or any of my old videos, because those were those those were good times. <laughs> I also have a bit of Hollow Knight as well. Back four years ago, gosh, it's such it, it, it's really amazing how old Hollow Knight is. Also a bit of Deadbolt as well. Man, it's so sad. The last thing I uploaded was an Ib and Ob fucking video. Three years ago. And then you see a short lifespan of some streams and then you see the Amori stuff and then you just scroll up and you see, oh yeah, a whole bunch of cool stream stuff. <laughs> Silk Song, yeah. Whenever Silk Song comes out, I'll definitely stream that and post that. You know, I've been actually thinking about coming back and doing gaming channel stuff, but just like, ugh. <laughs> I'm more, I, I'm more content doing Twitch than I am with doing YouTube, um, gaming wise anyway. Because, like, I like to be able to interact <laughs> with the f the fan base pretty much right here right now um the game machine got some reception though i'm not gonna say it didn't but Ugh. the videos i made back in the day like they're so dated <laughs> they're so very dated i need to play some more isaac down the line as well but that'll come with time 
that will come with time. But yeah, that's a nice little look back on my gaming channel. <laughs> Alright. Fun stuff. Fun stuff. Seven days to die a lot, yeah. Best of moments video. Yeah. Yeah. I've all, I've just been yeah I've really been thinking about doing like uh, compilation like comp well funny moments in uh, certain games like like uh, Deep Rock and Gunfire and. Streets of Rogue, those kind of games, but I feel like I feel like uh, I, I I never get like you always just you never give the editors nowadays enough credit because it's a pain in the ass to edit videos. I will say that it's not it, it horrible. It's it's not like I don't enjoy it, but it's just it's so. So time consuming. <laughs> the fucking an epic night terror video. I have yet to show you that, Bear. It's pretty good. Um, if you're interested, I can DM it to you after the stream. Um, it's it, it's the um, SKBO tale version of um, your best nightmare. And I can tell you right now, that fucking video was a pain in the ass to make. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I I don't know. I just I, I I find it hard to get into like editing, you know, gaming vids. So I just upload the bots. <laughs> but yeah. Whew. But yeah, uh, going back to Hello Charlotte, episode one, pretty good. It's free to download. Um, if you just look up Hello Charlotte episode one, it is free. You you can download it, you, you know, for Mac and for PC. I'm pretty sure there's a Mac download. Pretty sure. So, I recommend that. And you can also go on Steam to get episode two and three. I got it for sale because summer sale. Yeah. Got it for like five bucks. The uh, episode two, three, and DLC, so. It's gonna be fun to play. But as a rating, I give Hello Charlotte episode one a solid. solid seven and a half out of ten. I feel like. as. well. Nah, let's go with an eight. It's a free, it's a free game. I should expect some some stuff to be a little bit here and there. Um, some of the mechanics are a bit weird, you know. I mean, it's an old like I don't. Well, when did this game come out? That's a good question. When did this Hello Charlotte release date? <laughs> oh, June twenty fourth. Uh, the Hello Charlotte spinoff. Hello, Char uh, episode one release date. I don't know. Well, it's not saying. Oh, um, 2015. Yeah, okay. So, it, you know, pretty good. Pretty good, but pretty good while ago. Yeah. Uh, I feel like the, the overall mechanics are a bit, you know, a bit meh. I'm sure it, it, it's going to be improved in episode 2, considering it's on Steam and, you know, yeah. But we'll see. We'll see. For the first episode, I'll give it an 8 out of 10, because... Pretty interesting story. You know, and that's, that's the driving force of a game like that, is the story. And to have more, you know, content available that we're going to play later in life, I feel like 
that's a solid rating for episode one. It got it got the hook. It got it done, and I'm interested to play more of this. So, yeah. But yeah. Tomorrow, Ender Lilies. Hopefully, I can get my butt out of bed. We can play a good couple hours. Similarly, like last time, we played a good four hours, 40 minutes. <laughs> get my butt out of bed. Stream around maybe like 3 p.m. EST time. So, yeah. That'll be fun. Maybe earlier if I can, if if I can get, but if I can get out of bed <laughs> earlier, but but 3 p.m. is gonna be the standard. I'm going to hope to say. But yeah. Thank you all for tuning in to the stream. For those of you who did, much love goes out to all of you. I'll see you guys.